What's up everybody? Welcome back to another Last Raps Baseball video and today we are doing some Panini Optic. Panini Optic and for us there are 60 cards to a pack. I'm not a, a massive uh, huge Panini fan but uh, we haven't done any Optic yet and I've got a couple of packs we're going to do today and uh, tomorrow and we're going to find out how we do. Um, if it's anything like my Chrome, I could get really excited on it. And usually the Panini products, there's a lot more player autographs, on-card autos, numbered cards, those type of things. So that's what we're kind of excited to be able to get. For those of you who wish to see the odds of what we're looking at here, uh, and you want to pause the video, there are the odds on the back. And hopefully um, you're able to see that, stated odds and so on and so forth. But, uh, but for us, we're, uh, we're looking forward to, uh, to breaking this thing open, and I'm going to need my trusty teeth because uh, this is a little bit of a tougher pack in which to get open. There's 16 cards. I've not, um, I've not done, this, uh, done this before, but we'll see how the optic is going to work out in uh, these ones here. So we've got Jose Barrios to lead us off. I've got Vladdy Guerrero Jr. Vladdy Guerrero Jr. I have a Johan Mancata, Johan Mancata card. And then I've got Mookie Betts, Mookie Betts um, with the Dodger look or colors. I've got Raphael Devers of Boston. And now we're into the Lime Green parallels. We got the American League home run leader from last year, Jorge Soler. He's followed up by Anthony Rizzo, Anthony Rizzo. And we've got a Dustin May rookie card, a Dustin May of the Dodgers, and that's worth it. And then we saw Edwin Rios in one of our other videos. I don't know much about Rios, but I know playing first base, he's in a log jam there. And so now I've got a uh, stained glass Chris Bryant card, insert card. That's kind of cool. And then we have a George Brett throwback uh, from, what was that, 1991. And then I've got Marco Gonzalez, the pitcher for the... Um, Seattle Mariners as another one and then we were into some of the rated rookies I've got a Michael Baez for San Diego I got Adrian Morjan or Morion as well I've got Aaron Savelli who's been showing up a way too regular for us and then a Ketel Marti Optic Diamond King card well, I don't know about the variations on these cards. I know in the regular Dunruss, if you had uh, some different colors on the back of 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 the um, of the backs of the cards, or the baseball was a little bit different, uh, that would tell you that you have a short print or a, a variation or picture variation of the cards. But I don't know my uh, product being the Panini product all that well, so. If you see something or you see something that maybe I should know about, um, please leave a comment in the comments section. I'd be curious to know. I will look these up at a later date to see what I'm missing or what I have or don't have. But um, yeah, this is just a quick break. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, and uh, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. If you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Once again, this has been a Last Raps Baseball video production. We're coming back tomorrow with another 16-card value pack for Optic. So come on back and join us again. We look forward to seeing you. Have a great day, everybody. We're out.